tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I tried. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. I don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I've let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. Look, I'm already grounded. Snow, come on. Are you kidding? It's a glamour tube. Something's going on here. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! You gotta believe me. The guy isn't here, I promise! It's gonna be okay, Rachel. Please, I'm begging you. I don't wanna... I don't wanna get in trouble. Oh, hello there. When you do it that fast. What? Not sprightly enough? Why Rachel? Why the little girl? I don't think that's any of your business, Wolf. Why? How about because it works? That's why. That good enough for you? Certainly kept you two off the scent for a while. A short while. All right, start explaining. And from the beginning. None of this pathetic witchcraft crap is gonna prevent me from prying what I need from your gullet. Now tell me where Crane is. I ain't a fortune teller, Wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You have to know something. Unless you want a recipe for owl stew, there's nothing I know that would help. You're an accomplice to murder. Do you realize that? You might want to check your facts on that. He's trying to do empty threats here. It doesn't matter. I can't help you. I have no interest in being turned into a skink and crushed under boot heels. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Whatever it is, Greenleaf, whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something... We can protect you, okay? Whatever it is you're afraid of, we can make sure that it won't come to pass. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap. If she's afraid for her life, we can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! How dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two fables are dead because of this crap. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate very different means to handle it too and i don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives isn't there another way she's a witch can't she just work for us that way she'd be official you want to reward her for criminal behavior we can't trust this woman on the 13th floor. it doesn't matter because i'd never do it i'm not a house cat and i don't play well with others oh, trust me no one would confuse you for a cuddly animal bigby this is an order. Burn the tree. No! Look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Crane was here. He was here, and he left. He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that it will pierce the protection around the girls' speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. I'm sorry, but we still can't let you keep the tree. It wouldn't be right after what's happened. Big B. Please, Sheriff. Today is your lucky day, Greenleaf. I'm hiring you as the business office's newest witch in residence. But Big B! The witches over there will keep her out of trouble. And we have a glamour shortage as it is. It makes the most sense now. 
You get to keep your fucking tree. Just don't expect me to bow down to your little woman here. Don't think for a second that this is over. So what? Are moving trucks gonna show up here or something? Something like that. We'll call you. I think that was the right choice. Yeah, that's the That's Crane's car. No, it's nothing you need to concern yourself with. I don't think so at least. Shit. Hold on. Oh, do you miss a spot? Mr. Clean, come to smash up the rest of my place. Oh, I see. Come to audition, you bitch. Where's Crane? Ichabod Crane. What would that nerd have with a place like this? Tell me what you know now. Hey, well, busted. You can't just go in there. Oh, sure up. We have a problem. Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. Mr. Crane, please. She can't help. I know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I. Oh my god, Big B! Wait, don't! I, I, I didn't do anything, I promise you, I didn't do anything! These girls, the, the, the girls, they'll back me up. I just have to get the stupid ring working, that's all. They can't talk because of that spell, but once this ring gets through, I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over! That's all, please. I'm innocent, completely, completely innocent. It's just... Just let me show you. The ring won't work. Greenleaf sold you out. What? No. This will work. I assure you, it, it must. I, I, I went to you. Damn you. Come on. Please. Tell me who killed her. My lips are sealed. What? How many years has this been going on? Too... Too many. But I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just... I... It just... Oh, God! We found the photos of you and Lily. I know, I know. That's... That was... I just... I just love you, Snow. I love... I love you, and, and I'm sorry I'm not Prince Charming, okay? I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you and run away to Europe. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. Bigby? I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? He's not... He wouldn't be brave enough. Not to put his stamp on the world like that. He's a disgusting coward, not a murderer. What do you mean? You don't think he did it at all? If you'd seen the room... I don't need to see the room. There's a lot he has to answer for. There's a lot we all have to answer for. This is different, Snow, and you know it. You said you found evidence of him defrauding Fabletown, of using our money for his own ambitions. That's one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? There's nobody else that's even remotely... He's the prime suspect. There is nobody else. But why? Really? Think about it. Because circumstantial evidence is one thing. And I won't kill a man for that. I didn't intend for any of this to get so... You've been stealing money from Fabletown for years, haven't you? Yeah. 
We're not gonna kill you, so quit your shivering. Ichabod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fabletown funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses, but as of right now, you're coming with us. Get the fuck up. Now. I guess we know who's in charge, Sheriff. Sometimes it's fuzzy. You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. And you won't be in that oh, chair one minute. God damn it. You have to give up something you care about just so that wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of me. If I maybe took a little something back in return? Yeah, see, the thing of it is, we're better at this than you are. What are you saying? Yeah, I would like to break his nose, but uh, that's not gonna happen, like it. Oh yeah. other car. Oh. Hi. What you got there? Look, it's recently come under our attention that you're... How shall I put this? Attempting to claim what is the personal property of the Crooked Man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds. Pissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told them anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. What do you want? That sack of flour. Crane, dear. It's Crane. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Step aside. Tweedledee, what's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mundies call me? Wha what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, Bloody, Bloody Ma Mary. That's it. Thank you. And do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. Like golf, to relax. He's in custody, so move your car. I told you he'd never just give him up. I supposed to do there? Or uh, is this actually? Mm. Oh, we're still kicking.
Well, this is pretty messed up. That's not a normal. Oh, probably silver bullet. It was a good show, but you know, we just didn't know when to end. Oh, hello. Why do you have that? You know, you wouldn't think silver bullets would work on anything but a pure werewolf, but as it turns out, it's just. Right, Wolfie? Come on, come on, come on. I mean, hey, look, I know it sounds ridiculous, but really, guys. <laughs> Can you argue with these results? Because I know I can't. Wait! Stop! Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Just stop, please. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Snow. Don't do this. It's your lucky day, kid. Crooked man says it's okay with him. Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomach ache? Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no kill. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. Kinda like your boyfriend here. Too pussy to ruin a Tweedle's day. Well, this is gonna be a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. Out with the old, in with the new, long with the queen. I'm sure we'll be in touch. See you around. Lucky to be alive, and he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. This is getting worse by the minute. We don't have time to sit around and wait for their next move. I'll get things under control. Woody, I'm not gonna tell you again. Back off, dog. 
This doesn't concern you. What do you want to talk about? I just wanted to, um, about last night. After what they did to you, are you even going to be able to stop them? Don't hold out on me, Jack. You've always got some angle. Not this time. I know when a mark's not worth the trouble. Do you? Don't make me come down there to deal with you. I don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> then again, you don't have much choice at this point, do you? So let's see. Majority. I did what 40% of everyone did, apparently. But that's just really close. Did you offer Flake a job? Yeah, did. Did not burn the tree. Did you kill three of them? Huh. And apparently did. But yeah, that's it for this uh, part of the game. <laughs> so see you next time that I plan on recording soon. Bye bye.